Good morning, Paradise people. As I was editing yesterday's videos, I realized I did not video the outside of the hotel, so we're going to do that as we leave this morning. We just had breakfast, and what did you think of breakfast? Uh, it, plain. Plain? I, yeah, nothing special, but it was. I didn't even eat it all. Bowl of kanji, an egg, two sausage, and they just serve you this. You don't ask or get to choose. Oh, you're still hungry? No, I mean the food is not aggressive to the tummy. No, it's not, not spicy at all, spicy. no, no. Yeah. But it looked like they had pretty close to a full house. I mean, the dining area was full this morning. The parking lot's pretty full. Mm -hmm. But anyhow, let's go get out of here. We'll turn the key in and we'll walk around real quick before we jump in the truck. Okay. I grab your phone too. Oh, no, I don't want to eat my phone. It's a... Oh, we should, I turned the air conditioner off. So it's a two-story unit. I don't know how many rooms they have, but there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven right here. So I'm just going to say office is under this one over here. So I'm going to say probably 13 rooms. Well, I didn't even notice this last night. Nice little sitting balcony area there. But it did start raining at some point after we went to bed last night. But I would recommend this place for a one night stay, two nights if you got something local you need to do. Said so it is sprinkling, so we're not going to be out here very long. Ground's fairly well kept, other than this mud road the workers are putting through here for right now. You could probably use some paint, but... Huh? New hotel on the side. Oh, they're adding on? I think so. So she thinks they're... Ooh, it's all foggy. All right, my lens keeps fogging up, so I might not have got that upstairs area. It's pretty nice. Balcony sitting area right up there for the guests. Open to that upstairs hallway. Pretty decent grounds good location here on the river. It's just a bit out of town. This is where you get your breakfast right here in the mornings. But yeah, like I said, the parking lot was pretty well filled up. And as you just saw, quite a few people at breakfast and quite a few have went through there already, but main parking's over there. We have got a change of plans today. We are not going to stick to the makeup. We're going to go out into the mountains of the Northeast Thailand and, uh, place a mountain goat if the weather cooperates, but if, I'm not going to climb on slippery rocks. She's over there looking at me like, I like the truck so I can get in. I'm getting wet. We were just about to jump in the truck and some pit noticed this. There's a weaver bird made a nest in this tree. At least we think that's what it is, but he's sitting there looking at us. I'm going to see if I can get it on video. If you look real close right there. You can see his head poking out of that nest. This nest is mostly made out of string though. So I guess he's using what's available. I don't know if that's the parent to the babies or what is it, but uh, yeah, that's kind of cool.
So two and a half hours later, as we showed you as we were driving, we have arrived at Wat Utok. Uh, not sure if this is the Wat, which Wat is a temple, so I'm guessing this is it. But the real destination is right up there. You probably can't see it in the camera, but there is a walkway that goes up there somehow. There's actually a building. We're going to figure it out. We're going to go in here first or just head up there? All right. That's a good, a call, good call. To go up there and like meditate and stuff. I'm not going to be able to video this entire hike. You don't want to come here if you don't like stairs. As you can see, we've climbed a ways. We've got a long ways to go. Both go the same place. Huh? They both go the same place, right? Yeah, yeah. I imagine it makes a loop up above. It's more cutting these stones. You can tell they're cut. Oh, that was slippery. slippery. Oh. 
straight up, I think, is the quickest way. Figure out once we get up there. There's no signs. This might be a view. No, there's stairs. Let's see what the sign says up here. Make sure you eat your Wheaties before you attempt this one. Looks like a building there. I don't know where this goes. I can see it going around the edge of the cliff. I'll walk up here and look. I'll wait for her to get that last step. Set of steps. Here's the view right here. A view. I think there's another row of these up above. Holy shit. So that white thing is what we looked at right at the pond. The cave looking temple thing. We're gonna just push right to the top and then work our way down. Got a neat flower here. I think we should just push up. I think we should just push up there, get up, and then work our way down. A view. I don't know where it goes. There's no no signs telling us. I don't want to take the fast way down, I know that. I think everybody else went the other way. Keep my fat white ass close to the cliff. Because the bolts are coming out. to go clean your underwear. Holy shit. This looks a little precarious. Worst part is it's a rotten wood. Look at it. There's a freaking army of ants coming. I don't know where they're coming from. Clear back over by Psalm Pit. Are there ants on the handrail by you? Are there ants on the board? Two boards down? Molt? Molt my? Yeah, I can see them clear to you. Yeah. Freaking boards are gone, man. I know there's some soft ones. And they got a big trip hazard right there for you. Look at these boards. They're gone. Go. Good thing is there's a nice breeze right here. Oh, yeah. It is straight down. At least you got the trees to slow you down a little bit. ants are on that second board up on top of it down here they go all the way back over there down here I'm not going over, I'm not going over there look at that they go over there somewhere I'm not going there oh my god time to put the camera away it goes way up there okay 
We're gonna work our way to the top, I guess. These are some steep ass steps, man. That plateau over there. Ooh, these steps are not level either. And when they lean back, when you step on them, it feels like you're gonna fall backwards down the mountain. The cliff. Get up there and worry about getting down. Holy Christ, I'm lightheaded. The thing is, there's no signs to tell you. Huh? I don't know, maybe they carved them right up here out of this stuff. I'd imagine they put a pulley system up here somewhere, probably right here. Watch the boards. Some kind of a building up here. I see power running up here. See what's around this corner. Boy, these boards are spongy and it's just not, not a good feeling when you know how high up you are. That's the path less traveled there. I only see footprints in that mud. And that sun's over here, so we're going this way. We're getting close. Another 50 meters up. I think we're good. That's their uh, pile of fix it lumber. came up there that's where the I think that no I don't know where the ants were they're over there somewhere
right, I'm going to take advantage of this stop and get off my feet, turn the camera off and take a break. There's a Buddha up there. He's been here about 55 years. Watch that. Watch those rocks, they're slick. turn. I don't think that's going to happen. Sounds like this is six step Naga cave. Naga. We all know Naga today. Sounds like a back hole up here. They took a freaking helicopter up here. Getting dripped on. Try to find the dry path up these steps without slipping and falling with the one handrail here. Keep wrapped around it so I can hook it with my arm if I need to. Okay, I'm going to move over here, less dripping. here to really tell you where you should go. I'm about ready for a retirement nap. <laughs> what? A retirement nap. <laughs> oh, there's a staircase here. That made me the I grew right outside of that rock. The good thing is the air is quite a bit cooler up here. Not quite as humid as down at the parking lot. It's been a while before we've seen. It's been a while since we've seen how high we are. Yeah, I think this is it. You gonna go or you want me to go?
I hear people up here. Thirty meters. That's what she said. She said about thirty meters. See the side of seven floors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're getting. Don't lean against that and don't slip and fall and grab it. Cheese and rice. Holy shit. I think this way. I see shoe prints, so if we die, somebody might find us. Oh my god. Where is that? There was another catwalk here somewhere. Huh? I thought she said there was a view up here. A place to see, no? Is that what she said? No. Oh. I wonder if that's 30 meters this way or 30 meters up. Freaking slide off side of here. I can jungle to her on the top of a flipping cliff. It is straight freaking down here, people. Oh, I don't know where she'd come up with 30 meters. I know. I think we're near the top though. I'm here, I'm gonna keep going. Should have asked them if they came out the other way. Expecting this today. I 
mushrooms if you get hungry. Eight footprint. I see a footprint. Ain't much of a trail there. You want that freaking mountain jungle adventure? You got one. That's where she was in the little prayer room right below us is where all those monks were lined up, I think. One of those videos where it's like headline is Trekker videos his own death. Good thing is right here it's flat. Relax a little bit. There's no wind here though. Where in the hell is her 30 meters at? She's over there laughing now. It's freaking fools. I don't know where that other staircase is. That's the thing. Huh? You want to go back? Let's go. I'm going to turn the camera off so I don't slip and fall and die. I made it up. I want to make it down. There's another mountain right over there. Okay. We had to make a malaria prevention stop. We both got bit by a couple of mosquitoes. Figure we're out here in the jungle, we probably better get some spray on. It's freaking hot and humid now. All right, we're packed up. We are still right at the top of this freaking thing. So we just got back to the steps, the dirt passed right up there. Look at the sweat on my arm. Not you, them. <laughs> All right, we're gonna shut the camera off. We are gonna work our way down. Hey, uh, if we die on the way down and they find this camera, thanks for joining us, Paradise in Thailand. <laughs> bye bye. See you in the afterlife. All right, Paradise people, the adventure continues. We went down that flight of steps, steps where we put the uh, bug spray on, and uh, decided we'd just follow the level path around the mountain a little bit. Well, we've reached the, we come up on like the south east side of the mountain. We are on the north west side now. This path that just comes right straight down across here, but right here, there's a breeze coming through here. A very, you can see the leaves aren't moving, but I can feel it because I'm hot and sweaty. There's a look out here, but now that we found this around the north side, so I think we're going to walk over there in a second. She's down there checking out the view. Cheese and rice. The problem is there's no maps, no trail markers, no nothing to tell you where to go and how to get back. You just better pay attention. Let's see, I don't even know what the hell this is all about. Looks like steps down there somewhere. Oh yeah, people are coming down. Look at this rock out here in front of her. Oh, look on top of the hill. There's a pagoda or something up there. Son of a gun. We ain't going to find that. I'm going to go over here and see what's over here. See, I think this is the upper level. See, the top of the mountains right here is pretty close. A little part of an old beehive hanging right there. Anyhow, I think this wraps around the other side. It might come out on that trail we were on earlier. I don't know. I'm not gonna walk very close to her because I don't trust this damn thing. Don't ask me why I'm up here. I'm trying to see how it's tied to the wall. Lot of boards, man. Look at that big lizard right there. Skink. Some pit missed it. The worst part is I haven't seen any fat people up here. So I think I'm the fattest one that's been up here. I 
I don't want to walk on the same pair of boards that she's on. The support's going this way. I don't care about these. Look at this. I'm going to see if I can get a camera out there, though. There's two boards here. We'll stand on those. So we haven't been on any of those catwalks down there. We were on the other side of the mountain. I hope so. Yeah, see that? Yeah, I can see the Mekong way over there. But it should be, I can see it right there too. Makes me feel real good. <laughs> Wedged it in there with wood. Go, <laughs> stop. If you stop, we're just gonna turn around and go back. Go on, damn, I don't like this. Keep moving, I don't wanna get too close to you because too much weight in one place. There you go. Jesus. It's too much. Look at that cliff. So I don't even know where that trail is. We're on the complete opposite side of the mountain where we parked. I'm pretty sure, Jesus, look at that. The water falls from above us. God, that's a long ways down for me. I'm sure if you're a mountain climber, it's nothing, but. The bad part is we're not getting any closer to the bottom. We still got the entire trek down. Like I said, I just don't know. I'm guessing maybe we go up here, work our way down and come back this way and eventually end up back over around the other side of the mountain, I hope. Like I said, there's no maps or anything to show you. If, you know, we go clear over here and go down, do we have to come back up and go back? Or does it go back around? I don't know. It's my retirement nap place right there. under the end of that board. It's straight freaking down too. Holy crap. And these boards are soft, man. It's scary. It's hell. Like I said, I haven't seen any fat people up here. Oh, that board was loose and bumpy or flexy. Doesn't help seeing all these pieces of rock falling down here either. Who is that? Oh God. Jesus Christ. Cheese and rice. be on the east side right now we get around this next corner the big corner up here we should be 
back toward the truck, but a mile above it, however high we are, I don't even know. God, I need to just sit down and take a rest. See, I don't like this, where they got one little board between there, because if that thing falls, you're going. These here at least are across multiple supports. Well, those people either fell off or they found a way out because they haven't come back yet. Oh, it's all like, oh my God. Are you kidding me? It's, yeah, this is the way out. All right. See you at the bottom, I think. All right, Paradise people, I'm happy to say we survived. We've made it back down to civilization. Not exactly sure where we're at. I don't see that pond. I thought we walked. Where's the pond? Where's the pond? The pond with the sprayer and the temple in the middle. Is it around the corner over here? It's a lot type thing. There's a monkey over there. It's a monkey's. A monkey. See him? Right here. Right here couple babies. I don't want to get too close because I don't want to get bit by a rabid monkey. Smile! Got a couple babies over there. I don't want to mess with her too much. So that's not where we went out. Oh, here's another monkey right down here. one up under the Salah over there. Hang on to your shit. I think our truck's over there somewhere. How'd we end up here? It did? Well, maybe we didn't find our way back. We're gonna find our truck now. Apparently we come out somewhere. Oh, okay, when we come in, we come in around this way and then went over there to park. I know where we're at now. We survived, yay! All right, so we're on our way to the hotel. We stopped for, so she could get a little lunch. I don't eat lunch. Uh, but she wants some noodles or something before we go check in the hotel. And we're a little bit early for check-in anyhow, but just some little roadside restaurant looks pretty nice. Um, I see that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that was quite the trek. Uh, I knew it was going to be a trek when we headed out this morning, but it ended up probably twice what I expected. But hey, we made it up, we made it down. Um, 60 years old, but I feel good. I made it, stayed ahead of her, so that's all that really matters. Never felt close to having a heart attack, so that's all good. I think we're only like five kilometers from our hotel now, and I don't even know the name of it. Uh, right now, I think we're in Buong, Buong Kong Long, I think is the name of this village. Kind of on a picnic to wrap up the day. We didn't do much after the mountain climb. We went in and took a long retirement nap, and I started editing videos. Uh, some pit called in for some food. We're at a little resort thing near the mountain climb. Aged. Nobody else here. It's us. It's okay, though. We're in that little bungalow thing right there. Soy dog watching us eat. You got a mosquito on your nose. Get out of here. Actually, I don't know if they're soy dogs. They've been around here. Mosquitoes. But I got Pratka Pau and she got hairy. Oh no, that's not hair. That's from there. Shrimp. Shrimp. Shrimp mustard. He's like, what is that?
It's a cute little dog. So that was a pretty strenuous, strenuous, strenuous climb today um, for a 60 year old man. You're not 50. Almost. This smells good. So um, we're nowhere near a town. There's a little village right in here. Two kilometers, a kilometer, probably one kilometer. Is that where they brought the food from? Huh? Is that where they brought the food from, the yeah. village right here? Yeah. So her and the host, whatever you call them, um, just called in and then they, they brought the food out and then she set us up out here. They don't really have a dining area here. See if this dog will eat Pradka Pau. Hey, do do. I don't know how spicy it is. I haven't tasted it yet. He's eating it. I forgot to grab my Coke. I go get it. They really have no amenities here. Like I said, we're the only ones here. But I figured that'd be the case because we are in the middle of nowhere. Nothing but little villages all around here. We eat that whole spoonful of Pratka Pau and it's pretty spicy. I mean, it's not bad, but... Give him the part I don't like. They put too much basil in this stuff and for me most of the time. So that's a whole spoonful of basil. He doesn't like it either. Oh, perfect. Mosquito. It's okay? It's okay? Okay. Okay. Cap the crap. Um, it's got the mosquito thing here. But we still got the malaria prevention on from earlier, I think. Guess I should have tried to speak to her in Thai, not English, since I'm in Thailand. This is pretty good, though. I mean, I don't know if you can see it in the darkness, but there's a lot of chilies in it, but it's not too bad. I screwed up at Lotus yesterday. I normally get Coke Zero. Grabbed a whole case of this shit. Nothing but sugar. I'm trying to lose weight. But trust me, I worked off more calories than six bottles of this today. Not quite the ambiance we had last night, but... It's kind of nice. So we've wrapped up dinner. We're going to go back in there. I'm going to work on video edits all night. As you've seen, we had a lot of video from the mountain climb. Pretty much all of our video today. So thanks for joining us. Paradise in Thailand. Thank you for watching. See you next journey. Thank you. Bye-bye.